Welcome to Catherine Raker's World. Innovation. Culture. Adventure. Fashion and health. Artists. Destinations. Traditions. This is Catherine Raker's World. Hi, this is Catherine Raker of Catherine Raker's World, and I have two buddies next to me, Corinne and Kylie. And guess what we're going to make? We're going to be making kids' clocks. Kids' clocks. So, I'm going to tell you the story really quick, okay? My friend, Kylie and Corinne, is a doctor. And I met him in New Jersey when I lived near New York, right? And he decided that he had a whole bunch of watches in his drawer, but they were all broken, right? And he said, hmm, what can I do with these broken watches? So what he did was he made the first kid's time clock with old broken watches. So what he did was he didn't have the stickers like you have. Later on, the stickers, he got children from schools to make these kids time clocks for kids in hospitals. Because you know what? When you have cancer or you're really sick, time's a big deal, isn't it? Doesn't go very fast, does it? Do you have friends that, any of your friends that have been in the hospital before? Yeah. Yeah. And have you visited them? Uh, no. Not allowed? No. Okay, so they don't have a lot to do. So today we're going to make, guess what? Kids' time clocks, yes! Okay, so the first thing that we're going to do, Corinne, what do you think we're going to do? Uh, we're going to like put stickers like here. Right. And then we're going to put like these clocks, like where the 12 and the 3 is. On the top of the plastic, right? Like, so what we're doing, the first thing that we're going to do, what do you think is what we're going to do? Put stickers on Okay, the so clock. I need you to bring that clock over here. So we can do it. Let me move this, put it right there, and put your clock right here. Okay? Hold on a minute. Okay. So, do you have all your little things here? Hold on. There they are. We can do these last, but you've got to open your sticker thing up first. Open your stickers. And I'm going to make one too. Hmm. What am I going to make it with? Um, I'm going to do a happy birthday one. All Wait, right. Can we put the stickers here? Yeah, you put the stickers. That's the first thing we're going to do. Watch me do it, right? So I'm going to make a happy birthday one. So I'm going to put one there, right? One here. Because it could, you could like love chocolate cake or vanilla, right? What do you like? I like chocolate. What are you, Kylie? Chocolate. You like chocolate? Do you like ice cream? Yeah, I do like ice cream. I like both. Actually. Yeah, I love happy birthday cakes, right? So... What I'm gonna do, come on, you guys, you have to come on. Okay, so start putting your stickers on, right? Don't cover the, don't cover the, the number, so, okay? Okay. This is really cool, I love this. Look at that, happy, wow, that looks weird. Hmm, where can I put that? Oh, I'm gonna put it right here. How about that, Ooh. right? And then, um, so anyhow, you don't wanna get them near the, um, the hands, okay? So, you guys are doing it. Mm -hmm. Mine is just like kind of like random. There's just like yeah, just you can put them. You can put them anywhere, stick. actually, right? Yeah. So like if a if a, like a kid wanted to have didn't really want a theme, right. they were just kind of just like wanted anything. Right. They could, they could, I did this backwards. They have this. This isn't funny. That's weird. Okay, I'm gonna do it like that. Okay. Who cares, right? Yeah. And then I can put another happy here. Hold on. These really stick good, don't they? Surprisingly. Surprisingly, right. That looks a little strange, actually. I can't I get like it off mine. of there. It looks very nice. You Ooh. look real. Well, you girls are doing a great job. Oh, this color looks very nice. Isn't it? Yeah. I love it. What? I forgot. 
forgot to put the straw there. <laughs> right. So the whole idea is to put your stickers like this, even though this looks kind of quirky and wild, right? Yeah. So you want to show, when you're done, you want to show the camera what you did. Okay. Okay. I'm done. I'm just going to add this little green. Right. I, I love yours. So this Both is my finished yours. product. Not quite. you got to put the clocks on next. I wanna... Well, my finished product with stickers on it. What well, do you think? Um, I like... I like this color and the colors that I like on this one, on the stickers. Yes, because they're bright, right? Yeah, but I don't, yeah. They look like basketballs when you think about it. Yeah, but balls. Kelly loves basketball. It's her favorite sport. Is it your, okay, tell me what you did today. You won? Well, no, well, we only won one time, but the Sixers actually won the last game. But, um, right? like, tomorrow is the champion day, and whoever whoever teams wins the champion gets, I don't know. You don't know they what probably, you're... They probably get a piece of art. So what, yeah. let me ask this question. It's yeah. just, it's a camp, right? Yeah, it's a camp. Okay. So, it's like a gym. Yeah. So leave those stickers on. Are you done with your stickers? I just want to make them into a circle. Oh, okay. Hold on. you got to move this around. Do you want another one here? Oh, sure. Yeah, sure. Are you done with yours? Yeah. Oh, that looks really sharp. You want to show the camera? Yeah. Yeah, put I, it that way. I showed them already. Okay. And here's it again. Mine just has SpongeBob on it and crew and then these ladybugs and have these like um, old schoolish pictures. So yeah. I'm really proud of mine, the, the half product. Okay, so are you almost done here? Yeah, I'm going to like put one sticker right here. Okay. And one sticker sticker right I'm gonna make them the same color right so what's your favorite color Corinne uh, I like pink pink like pastel pink pastel pink wow what's your favorite color orange like orange that color like right there that's your I wear orange lipstick like that all the time oh my goodness we have to put something there Bill there okay that's good all right so the next thing we're going to do, are you done? Yeah. You're done. Okay. So I'm going to show you the next thing that we're going to do. We're going to take a break first and we'll be right back on Catherine Raker's World with Corinne and Kylie. Hi. Yay. We'll be right back. We're back from Catherine Raker's World from Rake. So, um, my product right now looks like this, but we're gonna add these on, on 12, 3, 6, and yeah, on 12. So this is what it looks like with the glass. Okay, so what we're doing next is I put glue on the, actually the back of this one clock right here on the number 12, okay? And girls, we're gonna do that for you because we're using super glue. Okay, and then what we do is we take and we put this tape on top of your little clock. Okay, so I need a couple more watches. Can you give me a couple watches from there, please? Okay, or give me that one. All right, so what I'm gonna do next is um, I will help you guys with this. So I'm painting this onto thing but you don't want to do this because it's super glue you have your mom or dad do it so I'm gonna put the six at the bottom right and I'm gonna do this like that pretty easy huh yeah the reason why we do that is is that when the super glue when you put the super glue onto it right or a really hard glue that it takes a little time to set up so you put the scotch tape over to hold it till it dries. Okay, can you hand me some more of those watches? Sure, I'll give so, you three. Okay, thank you. So what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna do this one, and then I'll put it on for you, or I'll put the, the super glue, and then you guys can do the taping part. How about that? Okay. Is that good? All right, hold on, let me just finish this. So I'm gonna put it on the three, right? like that that's why it needs the scotch tape right and i need one more hmm what color do you think 
Hmm. One more pink. What do you think, Corinne? A blue. A blue? I'll put the blue on the nine. Okay. So I have four different. I have four different times. Twelve. Three. Come on, talk to me. You know what the. Yeah, I know. Twelve, yeah. three, Twelve. six. Three, six, six, and nine. Right? Mm -hmm. Now, if you wanted to technically put them on all the numbers, right, you could. Right? Yeah. But we're not doing that. Right? So that makes it easy. Right? Oh, it looks like nail polish. Just see? Looks like nail polish, but guess what? You don't want little kids to do this because. What happens, girls? It will get sticks on your fingers. So, and, and, and super glue isn't fun, is it? No, it's really watery. It's really, well, it's not sticky. just watery. But look at this. Is it all done? Yes. <gasps> that looks so nice. Is that cool or what? It's cool. Now we usually, we usually have kids in schools make these, and they give them to the hospital where kids are. Like Ronald McDonald House. Do you know what that is? No. McDonald. Ronald McDonald House is where kids get to go when they have cancer right before the hospital and they stay with their moms and dads right next to the hospital and McDonald's has these places called Ronald McDonald House, right? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to put mine down. So who wants to go first, kids? I would. I would. You would like to go first? Yeah. Okay, so give me your clock, please. All right, so is that where you want them? Yes. All right. Okay, so I'm going to do this, right? Mm -hmm. Fingernail polish, like, kind of. Actually, this is a lot easier than it used to be for me because we used to do it different than that. So I'll put it right there. So give me the tape. Pull the tape off for me. Okay. And make it big. Not too short. All right, there's that. And then we'll put that on there. Right, now that'll hold it. Okay, you want to give me the next clock? I got it right here. Look at that. So, girls, tell me, what did you think this was? Uh, kids' clocks, but like it's for like what? children. That... I need such tape. Yeah, but you just asked me a question. Mm. Yeah, go ahead. Like it's like for people that have cancer and stuff. Yeah. Or sick. Or they're sick. Or say, for instance, one of your friends had the measles and they were in their. They were at home so long that they got bored. Yeah. Well, we could have this in their room, right? Yeah. That's cool. Okay, this you did a really good job on this girl. Thank you. You're welcome. What about me? I was getting to you next. Don't worry. <laughs> that was really. Do you know what? I have three boys or two boys and one girl. Do you know that? No. Yeah, I do. Guess what their names are. Kylie. No, that's my niece. Oh. Hmm. Robert, Jennifer, Ooh, I like that and name. Jeffrey. <laughs> Jeffrey. I like Jeff. that. Jeffrey is as old as your dad. Wow. Wow. He's What's not this? that old. How old are you? Eleven. You're I'm eleven. Six. I'm six. I'm and seven. you want to be twenty-one? No. no. So show the show the audience your beautiful clock. Now. Okay, so this is uh, my finished product in three, two, one. It looks like this, and I'm really proud of it. I really like it. It's really unique, and I've never seen a clock like this before. And I'm super excited to hang it up in my room. So, thank you, kids. Clock, clocks. All right. So Kylie, tell me where you want them. Okay. okay. Okay, so I want the grape one right here where the nine is. Okay, hold on, let me get it on here. All right. Can I have her, can you do the tape, somebody? I will do the tape. Okay, so hand your sister the tape. All right, so we're gonna put this one this way, right? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> I need the tape. We have gotta make it long. All right, how, this That's one? good, all right. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Whoops. Oh, wow. You know, that's the bad thing about tape. What do you think? It, because it's too sticky. Yes. All and right. It's so like your fingerprints in it. Yeah. Okay. So tell me, well, you're going to take that, Dad's going to, your dad's going to take that plastic off when it dries. Okay. Okay. So now where do you want this green one? I want to put it right here where the six is. Oh, that's cute. All right. So, hold on. 
This is good. Oh no, don't, don't get it. You know, without my glasses, it's tough to see. Okay, need more of that. Okay, Wait, you got it. glasses? Yes. Guess what happened? I went to the eye doctor yes. and I couldn't see things really clearly. And the doctor said, let's take an eye test. So you know the eye test you take at school? Yeah. Well, they put all these numbers up. So they tell you where, which, where do you want me to put this one? Um, I want to put it this on the three. Okay, so the other way. Okay, so they said, how many lines can you read? I can only read two lines. They said, guess what? You need glasses. I went, no, I don't want to wear glasses. I wore glasses when I was a little kid. Right? I need the tape. Oh. You're, you're not doing your job. Come on. Okay. Good. All right. I want to put that one at the top of the 12. Top of it? Okay. Hold on. Let me do this so I don't get it wrong. Okay. Because you don't want to use super glue without who? All right. Your mom and dad. Right? That's really important, girls, right? Yeah. Why? Because it's important that you, because if you stick it a lot, if you, right. if you stick it a lot, it'll do what? It will um, stay on you forever, but if you only wash it off with extra good stuff like I, that, like that got on me. Sometimes, sometimes, let me tell you girls, you have to go to the hospital. You got to do this for me. This is your job. Come on. Okay, keep on forgetting. And guess what? I know somebody that had to go to the hospital to get it unstuck. Seriously. Well, I got it unstuck at home because Dad helped me. He helped you? That's good. So you don't want to play with it. You want your mom and Dad to do it, right? Yeah, I just didn't know that was super. I didn't know that was extra super Okay, glue. so this super glue is going to your dad, right? And he's going to take it home with him. I'm going to give you both of them, all right? Okay. Now, look at you. You want to show your clock? All right. So my clock looks like this. Ray! That's awesome. I want you girls to know that this has been so fun, right? Yeah. yeah. And you could do this at home with your who? Mom and Dad. Or your grandparents? Yeah, like you. Like you. Like me. <laughs> like a person like me. Grandparents, right? Mm-hmm. See, I don't look as old as I used to what we talked about, right? Good. I'm glad you said that. Okay. So I've been doing this a long time, and I love working with kids. So let's show these. And then what are we going to do, Corinne? You know, there's a little girl that's sitting next to me named Corinne. And I have to tell you, she was the one that told me about what? Smishy mushies. And I hear a little bird told me that you love these things. They're really nice. They're really cool. I love them. And you know what? The, the people from Rio's, thanks to you, mm -hmm. I went and saw them at the Chicago Sweets and Snack Show. And I met the owner and the founder of the company. Mm -hmm. And he said to me, I want to send this little girl all these wonderful, beautiful things. And so tell us about your collection. Tell us all about it. So um, I started collecting Smushy Wishies when they first came out from series one to two to all the seasons. And um, what Smushy Mushies are is they're squishies. They're like slicing foam. It may sound a little bit crazy. Grown-ups don't really know how to squish them and all that. But like they're just like they're just really cute faces. Like this is a the bento one. It's bigger than the normal Smushy Mushy. I'll show you guys that in a second. And these are the little besties. So my collection, I just have like a lot of them. I love Smushy Mushy. So now you can open it up, right? Yeah, so her name is Harper Hippo, and that's Emma Aggie, sorry, and Wanda, Wanda Waffle. And these are supposed to smell like ice cream. Ice cream? So let's, uh, okay, so the first thing I see is this collector's guide, and it says, supposed to smell like strawberry, strawberry ice cream, and it comes with a little plastic name tag. Just open this up. So these are the three ones you can get. And I already have this one. 
And now I have this one. And the last one that I need to collect is this really cute um, takeout Chinese food one. Because it's a really cute dumpling. And then on the back it has word search and stuff. That's really cool. Now the next thing. Oh, this is so hard to open. Want me to help you? I got it. You got it? Yeah. This smells like strawberry ice cream. Wow. This is what it looks like. It looks like cereal. These are smushios. Ooh. And it's really soft and slow rising. So that's Can really I smell cute. them? Yeah. Oh my goodness, they smell. Did you smell these? No. Can I let her smell it? Yeah. Smell it. Mm. What does that smell like? It smells like raisin. <laughs> <laughs> So here it is. Now I understand why you like smushy mushies. Yeah. So funny. Now I got this little cute egg. Like you could eat this with your cereal. And this one is super cute and solarizing. And then it comes with this little bestie bottle. It says you can smash the bestie in there, but there's no way this one is going to fit in there. So let's open this up. And it comes with three little ball chains. It comes with a pink one, a teal one, and an orange one. So they're super cool. And you could just close it up. Now the last one is this really cute waffle and it's a blueberry waffle and it's so cute with butter on it the last one comes with a little sticker that looks like this girl here in her and it says excellent so that's what came in this kit wow that's pretty exciting don't you love it yeah and i know that you're going to uh, take over the show in a little while and you're going to actually do a whole thing for children that from your collection am i right Smushy Mushies? Yes! Yes, I love them. Hey, today I'm going to be reviewing Rad's Candy. So, as you can see right here, these are the Smushy Mushy ones. And I have a whole bunch more characters to show you. But, first I'm going to be explaining what Smushy Mushies are. So here, I have a masterpiece. And it is a Smushy Mushy fridge. And I've been collecting Smushy Mushies for a, a very long time. So when I found out that they had Smushy Mushy Rads that come with candy, I really needed to get some. So let's open it up. You can see that there is a lot of squishies in here. And it's a little bit different than the ones I'm gonna show you. They're slow rising ones, but there's no place to put the candy. So that's all they are. But they're just like squishies, like they're like stress relievers, but like they make cute characters and cute kinds and stuff. And they decorate them to make you like wanna buy them and stuff. And I think they're really, really cute, so I love Smushy Mushy so much. So now, let's just open these up. So these are the candy dispensers, and you can collect them all. You can get Felina Fawn, Popsy Piggy, Babesy Bear, and Bitsy Bunny. So let's open this one up. So it looks like this design um, has like pancakes, looks like a breakfast one. It's really cute, and it comes with a little poster or collector's guide, so let's just open it up. Yep, look how cute that is. You can hang this up in your room if you wanted. That would look super cool. Then it comes with candy. This looks like a more pink-green kind, not so fruity, but it looks still good. And then here is the little candy dispenser, and it is plastic and you can hang it on whatever you want. Sorry, hang it on your rat pack and everything. And what you do is you fill it up right there, the little candies in there, and you pull this back and then, it, and then the candy goes right there. So it's really cute and then to get it back on, you just twist it on. So Rads, you did a really good job on that. Now I'm gonna be showing you guys the other ones. This is the squishy kind. So you know the ones that I was just showing you, Smushy Mushy? Like, this one, this is the slurizing one. These are one of the other Smushy Mushies and Rabs and Smushy Mushy teamed up. You can see they're slow, like squishy, but this little capsule in there has candy. So you can like pull it out and it looks like an ordinary squishy and you could just have some candy in your hand and eat it. And then you could just put it right back in, which looks really cool. So. This is really cute, and this is the donut, and it kind of looks like the little, you know, bestie of this little bunny. See, right there, they have a difference. Super cute. So this one has like a neon pink color, and yeah. 
It's really cute. Now we have another one, which is the s'more, and this s'more is super cute. You can see this capsule is empty. You can leave it empty. You could just have it as like a cute little toy, or you can fill it up with candy, and you can both hang these too, and they're like one of those clips that are really made. So good job on that too. The next ones that are really genius because they look like lip balms. These are the pick me pop ones and these are so cute. And what you do, it's kind of like a little dispenser. It is, but like, like kind of like a salt one. You would like open it up like that. Then candy comes out. And to close it up, you just put it back and you don't know that there's candy in it because it just looks like a little lip balm. So it looks really cute. And this kind of looks like a little mouse one. And I have two more that I'll show you. This one is like another mouse and it has more colors on it. And this one looks like a cute little cat or whatever it is. And you can fill these all up with candies and they sound like little shakers. And the last two ones I'm gonna show you are SpongeBob ones. So for boys, if they wanna get rads or for girls, whatever you want, you can buy SpongeBob ones and a whole bunch of other ones. But I thought it was cool that I got the SpongeBob ones because the SpongeBob ones are really cute. And I just think they're really cute. So this is SpongeBob, he has a blue clip. And there's no candy in him because this is just an example that you can put candy in him or not. And he's slow rising and his little eyes are all sparkly like he's looking at somebody. And then we have Patrick, the starfish and um, candy. I accidentally put the wrong candy in there, but that's okay. You just take it out and you can have some candy. You can put it back in. You can hang it on whatever. Thank you, Rads, for sending this stuff to me. I really am happy of what I have. And hopefully a lot of other kids buy these too because I am super happy that I have these in my squishy collection and I can hang them on whatever. These are really stylish and cute. So yeah, thank you. We'll see you soon. And don't forget to go to our website at katherinerakersworld.com. We're on all over the world with our show. So don't forget to tune in. See you soon. Bye.